bedroom. <laughs> Look for the stinky skunk. And Look for the stinky skunk and his jewels. No, his treasure. Fuck, I spelled treasure. <laughs> this is a mansion of the rich stinky st skunk. Apparently. This is a you terrible idea. I don't know why we made this treasure. mansion. You walk towards the stinky skunk's room and find a small key hanging by a string. You take it and unlock the door. A skunk appears and a foul loader hits your <laughs> No! Son of a bitch! Son of a bitch! God damn it! This is this Sephiroth's mansion? No, 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 this is a different mansion, Yogurt. Sephiroth's in a different mansion. This is the skinky, stinky skunk's mansion. Get your mansion straight. Hmm. All right. What do we do about this? <clears throat> okay. I'm gonna <laughs> like night easy with all the stink. All right. Burn the room down. You burn the room down. You lock the door and set the room on fire. You open the window and toss a lit firebomb out. The firebomb explodes and you duck back out of the room and run. Why'd we open a window and then throw a firebomb? Kill all the witnesses. You kill all the witnesses. Don't forget, Heather. Heather's with you me, of course. You walk down the hallways until you come to a room with several stuffed animals in it. You stop and listen. You hear the muffled sounds of children's voices from inside. Destroy Master Skunkalo. Well, this is creepy. What do you make of this, Heather? You say, well, this is creepy. What She's a witness? No, Heather? I can't kill Heather. I think there are kids in there, Heather says. Maybe we should go look for the treasure without killing them. You shrug and step towards the door. The children's voices get louder and more clear. You said we should kill everyone now. You say you said we should kill everyone. Yeah. But I think we should still look for the treasure, Heather says. All right, that's fair. That's fair. Heather has her priorities straight. Heather's not a witness. She's an accomplice. It's very different. We'll kill her later. Where do... All right, we're busting open the door. Bust down the door. You bust down the door. You hey, just try. And bust down the door open to find several cribs filled with stuffed animals. What the hell you say? There aren't supposed to be any kids here. Heather says. <laughs> Son of a bitch! There weren't supposed to be any goddamn kids here. There's day before, but you didn't see. I I saw. I said, uh, "Hey, just cry," but I think you left by then. I was doing other stuff. Is problematic. There weren't supposed to be any goddamn kids here. This has. To be a trap. You say this has to be a trap. Heather shrugs and runs into the room. You follow her in. Children. Heather shouts. What's going on? Oh. The children don't respond and just stare at her. 
The children are creepy here. Okay. What do we make of this? You can't kill children. Shake one of the children. You shake one of the children. You grab a stuffed animal and shake it. It's nothing but air. Well, this is disappointing. You say, let's just. I did get not the say we. Have I grab one of the stuffed animals. Uh, retry that. You grab a stuffed toy and shake it. Use your superpower to make all the kids' teeth fall you out. Speak, you say in disbelief. Are there more of you? Heather asks. Where are your parents? Okay. I, I'm getting the stuffed toys are the children. Open the stuffed animal. Stuffed toy. You open the stuffed toy. We're, we're... You Look. open the toy and find the note. <gasps> it says... It says... It says... What does it say? You read the note. I am happy to meet you, it reads. Yo, what does that mean? Maybe, maybe the uh, note can respond to voice. Writes in note, beanie babies are real babies. No, no, we're writing in the note. We're writing the note. You wanna see some teeth fall out, Jimmy? Look, we're, we're getting to it, okay? There's no children here. It's only stuffed animals that sound like children. They don't even have teeth, okay? We're getting to it. Just give me a sec. Right. Nah, nah. What do you mean? We're getting to a mystery. What do you mean? I mean, I am happy to meet you, Heather says. I didn't tell you about the stinky skunk's treasure because I didn't want you to get in trouble with your parents. What? <laughs> oh my god. That means Heather wrote the note. Heather was here first. Oh my god. Oh my god! What the fuck does that mean? I need more alcohol for this. Alright. What do we know? It was all a trap by Heather. It's looking that way! You're the accomplice. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, open another stuffed animal and see what it says. You open another stuffed toy. You open another toy and find a note. It says I am happy to meet you too. Do you want to play a game? Sure. Let's go. You say, Heather, did you write these notes? Heather, I need some explanation. No, they just appeared in the stuffed toys, Heather says. Cut the bull! Shit. Hev. That's what I'm calling Heather from now on. Hev. Cut the bullshit, Hev. 
I know you are behind this. You fake up the bullshit, Heath. I know you are behind this. No, I'm not, Heather says. Yes, you are. No, I'm not, yes, you are. You and Heather begin to argue and argue. <gasps> okay, we're doing this one. This one's more interesting. Okay, I admit it, Heather says. I wrote the notes. Why, you ask? Because Heather starts to say... You both five now? Listen to what she has to say. You listen to what she has to say. Heather tells you that she is in love <laughs> with you. Son of a bitch! Heather, you just married a priest. <laughs> Heather! You just married a priest! <laughs> like, five minutes ago. After bringing me to a marriage. After bringing me to a marriage where she said she wanted to marry me. She married the priest instead. And now made me accomplice to this weird thing where we burnt the stinky skunk's room. And now she's telling me she loves me? Oh my god. What do we do with this information? Alright, do we play with her heart? Do we say, but we're in love with Donkey Kong? Do we play with her heart? Do we play with her heart? I love Heather. Don't get me wrong. I love Heather, but I can't have her... I can't have her playing with my heart. Okay? With my heart. So we need to play hardball. I need input from chat. What do we do? Master Skunkle is tricking you. <laughs> what do you mean? You just married the priest. Oh fuck, how do you spell priest? Carry her on the spot. Okay, one sec. Right, okay, right now we marry her? Alright. I like this idea. On the spot. Yeah, I'm in love with her too, you say. What? Heather asks. Yeah, <laughs> I'm in love with her too, you repeat. Really? Heather asks. Oh my god, that's so good. Can you imagine saying, somebody saying, I love you? Yeah, I'm in love with her too. What? Yeah, I'm, I'm in love with her too. Really? What? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Notice Heather is a figment of your imagination created by Master Skunkle. It's not Master Skunkle, it's just this Master Stinky Skunk. But don't you love the priest? Is the stinky skunk? Wait, fuck, how do you spell skunk? Hey, I was right for it. Messing with your head. You say, but don't you love the priest? Is the stinky skunk? I love the priest, Heather says. But I'm in love with you. You look at her and nod. All right, it's a poly, uh, poly, eh, poly polygamous relationship. Then let's have a polygamous 
relationship. You say then let's have a polygamous relationship. What? Heather asks. A polygamous relationship you say. You want to have two loving partners? Heather asks. That sounds really... She's invented the stinky skunk. Kiss her. You kill her. Whoa, no! Wait! Wait, no! <laughs> wait, no! <laughs> wait, no. <laughs> wait, 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 I'm in Drake's. <laughs> well, now I feel like we gotta go with that, right? Do I just accidentally kill her? <laughs> Fuck. It's kill all the same thing. Oops. <laughs> Do we stick with this? I, we have to stick with this right now, right? Kiss, kill, it's all the same thing. Yeah, exactly. Sorry, baby. I only love Donkey Kong. You say sorry, baby. I only love Donkey Kong. You give her a long, deep look into her eyes. I'm sorry you say and begin to cry. You leave the room and walk down the hallway. You see a guard sleeping. Well then. Oh god, oh fuck, oops. <laughs> no, 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 no. I can't, I have to stand by my actions. I accidentally killed her instead of kissing her because I'm drunk and misplaced the L and S key on the keyboard. Have make out with DK. We, I'm currently in a building. Okay, we can do it later. Donkey Kong. Wait, seduce the guard. You have Donkey Kong seduce the guard. You walk up to the guard and reach down to wake him up. Wake up. You say and give him a small shake. Don't hit me. That's not what I said. Retry that. You walk over to the guard and whisper in his ear. He wakes up and grabs his gun. Who are you? He asks. What's it look like? You answer. Alright, you know what? I get, we'll, we'll see how this goes. I'm your new boyfriend. You say I'm your new boyfriend. Shut up, the guard says. You look at him and realize he is wearing a mask. You punch him in the stomach and he grabs his gun. What the hell are you doing? He asks. He didn't get seduced by me! You say honestly, I don't really know. I'm not gonna What's rape going him, on? okay? He asks. I don't know. I woke up in here, you <laughs> say. We're being held hostage by some psycho, the guard says. Wait, 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 no, no, no. No, no, that's not, that's not what's happening. Do you know where me and Donkey Kong can get mare? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pro Dr. Stink is messing with your head. Oh, Dr. Stink must be the reason why I, uh, why I killed Heather. Oh, it all makes sense.
You say Dr. Stink is messing with your head, calm down. Okay, I'll, I'll ask him that next. Never takes off her mask. <gasps> what? Listen, she says. I came here to meet you because I love you. The guard grabs his gun and points it at you. Don't move. <laughs> Dude! What is going on? Heather is alive? You say Heather. I thought you were dead. The guard fires his gun. The bullet goes. How is the AI the doing mind blowingly you. good? Oh shit! Wait. Ah, uh, that's. I think. It's, I think the story ends here. What a way. What do you. What? This is, uh. You say I always loved you, Heather. <laughs> you were the dead one all along. I loved you too. Do you think I will survive this? Let's do another. You say, I do think you so. Think I will survive I, this. We will. Don't worry. Of course, you die, and your soul goes to Stinky's treasure. <laughs> dead i'm dead that's the perfect ending that's the perfect ending we gotta start new we gotta start a new one we gotta start a new one that was the perfect ending thank you wing the ultimate nug come on slam welcome to the jimmy jam welcome to the cult oh my god <laughs> I love me saying, do you think I'll survive this? She goes, yeah, of course. And then I instantly die and my soul goes to Stinky's treasure room. <laughs> oh, somebody needs to clip that, please. Okay.